Johnson, and this is my fourth installation on why relationships fail. If you're first time tuning in, my name is Ronald Johnson, and what I'm trying to do is create more awareness about living better life and better relationships. So, if you missed my videos before, the first three videos, if you're on YouTube, link below would be the first three videos on reason why one, reason two, and also reason three. But today, let's talk about the fourth reason why relationships fail. Reason being is that most of the time we go in a relationship because the person provides us pleasure. Now, pleasure doesn't mean just sex or just intimacy. Pleasure can be hiking. Pleasure can be fancy cars, dinners, travel, happiness, smile. They make me feel a certain way. If I didn't have them, life wouldn't be the same. So what tends to happen when we have a pleasurable relationship, we get obsessed about something. I'll give you a good example. When I was going through my pleasurable stage relationships, I was constantly of the situation where the way I give love is where I receive love. So I want to give all these women a lot of gifts, especially ones where I want them bad enough, give them a lot of gifts, give them a lot of things to show that I love them and I care. But when it comes to pleasure relationships, that does not work. Because regardless of how many gifts I showed her, it never worked out. And regardless of how much I tried to send the roses, try to send the best man out there, it never worked. Matter of fact, one time she told me this. There's so many guys that want her, what I have to offer her? These guys that are millionaires want me, what I have to offer? In that instance, I felt about this small, but because I didn't have enough confidence, she picked on my insecurities. And that's okay. That's okay. I made it. And that was a relationship for me anyway. So I'm happy about that. So when it comes to pleasurable relationships, we have to realize is that if that's a man, let's say, and a man provides you a sense of financial freedom, a man or a woman, doesn't really matter, and that financial freedom goes away, that he or she loses their job, what next? That pleasure of having that financial security is gone. So what do you do? Well, because you only join a relationship out of pleasure the things that made you happy, the things you thought you needed, the things you thought you would lack. And when they're gone, the sense of the relationship is also gone as well. And that actually hurts you in the long run because you only look for one, two, or three things that give you a lot of pressure. So that's one fourth reason why relationships well fail because we come to relationships with pleasure, wanting to feel good. They give us a need that we lack. And when we find it, oh my God, I feel so happy. And this is why you fail. So if you guys want to learn more about why relationships fail, don't forget to hit the subscribe, subscribe button if you're on YouTube. But if you want to learn how to better relationship with yourself and your high performer, I want you to go to www.ronjohnsoncoaching.com. Click on the discovery call button or click on the masterclass button. Let's talk. Let's connect together. I look forward to talking to you soon. Thanks for listening.